Now, families in the Tabanchu area east of Bloemfontein in the Free State are about to be handed their land back. The legal process for land to be returned to communities was announced earlier today. Well, let's get more clarity and information about this. I'm joined by Hossi Khaboilelui Moroka. Hossi, good afternoon. Welcome to today. Thank you very much uh, uh, for your time. What, what was announced today? What is this agreement you've reached uh, with the uh, Afri Forum in the Tabanju area? Uh, greetings, uh, Ramoyani. Greetings to the viewers, ENCA viewers. Um, so today, what we, the, 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 what the announcement that was made uh, is that we have embarked on a process of basically reclaiming our land back. And within the law, Act 112, of 1991, which speaks about section 20 thereof, speaks about upgrading of um, land tenure. And as you know, a traditional community and that they preside over. And this, what we did today is basically to request um, uh, the Minister of Land um, Reform um, that we, as a traditional community, request the transfer of our land, which is um, a land that has been proclaimed, uh, land parcels that we know, um, which is communal areas, to be lawfully um, under the 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 the. the Community, so that um, we are able to move as as, as um, traditional leaders. I think what we don't understand is that it does not really make sense to say you are a traditional leader yet not in charge fully. In this is what we are trying to do, especially because we also seek to develop our areas. We want to see our people thrive. Yeah. We want to see um, ending hunger, ending poverty, ending unemployment. We also want to play a part in that. So that was what was happening today. Okay, and the legal process, I understand you're gonna be assisted by Afri Forum, am I correct? Yes, that is true. Um, we have been working hand in glove with Afri Forum, not just on They also assisted, assisted us with our uh, chieftaincy or traditional leadership um, uh, case, dispute case. And um, taking from that, we then requested them as a traditional community because we do. We requested them to assist us in acquiring our land back. And this is a, a call to basically all other traditional communities, mm. because in fact, um, there has been a res resolution. There is common understanding within the sector of traditional leadership as a whole, that the 13% of land, which is arguably 13%, um, is that, that we preside over should be transferred to the, the respective communities. But the implementation thereof institution, a national land summit as an institu the institution of traditional leadership earlier this year. Uh, and this is a conversation that has been going on for years. So when we did really our homework and tried to see how best can behind, we are lacking behind. Um, the challenges that we face are real. They are real time um, challenges that we need to find solutions for. And one of those solutions is that really, if we don't have land, how do we say yeah. we, we, we can do anything? Yeah, it, it, may, it makes sense. But I just want to point out that, unfortunately, your connection with us is not 100%. We keep on losing you here and there. So, so f just v v what, what are the next steps now? And how big is this area of communal land 
in and around uh, uh, the, 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 the traditional community of uh, Barolong, Busileka. How big is it? Thank you, Remen. So what we are talking about, we are talking about the proclaimed areas and we not withstanding the fact that we also have land that um, is unproclaimed. Proclaimed, which is an area, an area of about almost 80,000 um, hectares of land. And most of them are uh, parcels of land that are surveyed. So it makes it even easy for the transfers to be made. And yes, um, that's that's. OK, the next steps very briefly, the uh, Jose Moroka. The next, the next steps? steps, the next steps we have written to the minister. Uh, the minister is to respond to us in writing. Um, and I must mention, we are saying this is a cordial process, really. We tend to take things out of context. So the minister, we expect her to respond um, in the next month. And we have given uh, the time frame of the next three months for the process to be concluded. And you're stressing that it's a cordial process. We'll, we'll be in touch and in the near future because we know how important the issue of land is, especially for a Jose like yourself, for your people of uh, Barolong Bosileka in Tabanchu. Thank you very much, Jose Moroka. This time that's uh, uh, Jose uh, Chabo Ilelui uh, uh, Moroka just talking about this new agreement, the announcement that's been made today for them to reclaim the communal land under Barolong Bosileka, Kotabanchu in the Free State.